If you are getting an F09 code on your display, this fault occurs when the control does not read the flame single when the gas valve is open on a startup. Note that the unit will retry the ignition sequence three times before locking out again. First, press the reset key and monitor the ignition through the observation window located on the burner plate. If you get a flame and after a few seconds the flame goes out, go to the system parameters and monitor the flame single. The flame single should be greater than the minimum level of 0.6. If the single falls below this level, shut down the unit and clean the flame rod and reinstall to see if the flame single improves and corrects the problem. If you're still having an issue, measure the incoming gas pressure to assure that you have enough gas or not getting significant pressure drop in the gas line above 2 inches of water column when the unit goes to light off. If you experience high pressure drop, you will have to check your gas regulators and your feed piping to the appliance to assure they are sized correctly. Once corrections are made, restart the unit and monitor operation. If you are not getting a flame when you press the reset key, you will need to check the following. Be careful as the unit may be hot. Let the unit cool down before proceeding. Make sure all repairs are double checked and leaks are verified and sealed before recommissioning. The first thing you'll need to check is check the incoming gas pressure to make sure your incoming pressure does not exceed the range of the gas valve between 3.5 inches and 14 inches of water column. If the gas pressure operates outside of these limits, the unit will not ignite. Second, check the unit's gas valve to assure you're getting flow of gas into the combustion system. This can be done by monitoring the gas pressure when you go to start the combustion. You will see a slight pressure drop on the incoming gas meter. You can also put a screwdriver on the solenoid of the gas valve coils to assure they are energized. Coils will be magnetized when activated. If coils are not magnetized, you will need to replace the solenoids on the gas valve. Third, check the spark gap and clean the spark to assure arc will energize across the ends of the spark. If spark is dirty, the arc could arc back to the faceplate or the ceramic chamber. Repair or replace depending on the condition of the spark igniter. Fourth, check venting lengths and double check inlet air to assure the unit is getting adequate combustion air. If you're still having problems, please call the factory for further assistance.